The Indian Air Force showcased a vibrant display of skill and precision, as 51 aircraft participated in a spectacular fly-past during the 75th Republic Day ceremony today. The aerial performance captured the attention of onlookers, as the contingent soared through the air, creating a resonant roar and showcasing a series of captivating mid-air acrobatics. Airbus and the Tata Group have joined forces to jointly manufacture the H-125 single-engine helicopter for commercial use, and the helicopter assembly line will be established in Gujarat. The DRDO is developing artificial intelligence-powered electronic pilot for Tejas Mark 1A, and advanced variants will probably find its way to the Tejas Mark 2 and AMCA. A high-powered contingent from the United States will visit Delhi tomorrow, and the group will participate in a closed-door seminar and hold key bilaterals. The DRDO chief has said that the first order of 307 advanced towed artillery gun systems will be placed before the end of the current financial year, which is before 31st of March 2024. The Indian Air Force chief has announced that the deliveries of the 83 Tejas Mark 1A aircraft will begin next month, paving the way for the induction of a new squadron along the western border in March 2024. Pakistan is all set to receive an investment of $1 billion from Russia and the United Arab Emirates to upgrade its railway sector. Reports suggest that during the ongoing visit of French President Macron to New Delhi, India will announce French firm Safran Aerospace as its engine partner for the sixth-generation jet engine development for the AMCA program. The RDO and Safran will collaborate to build a brand new 130 kN engine from the ground up, and this new core promises to be a true sixth-generation powerhouse powering not just the AMCA, but also potentially powering an even more advanced fighter jet in the future. India also plans to replace the American F-414 engines on its Tejas Mark II and Ted BF fighter jets after their usual 10-year service window, which opens up another potential avenue for the Indo-French engine. The Indian Air Force chief has said, that the ongoing Tejas Mark II program will act as a feeder technology for the AMCA. The Tejas Mark II program will share significant technological advancements with the AMCA, that includes sensor assembly, auxiliary computer, digital flight control computer, weapon management computer, and weapon interface computer. By mastering the technologies and gaining operational experience with the Tejas Mark II, the Air Force will be well positioned to seamlessly transition to the AMCA. India's JSW Group has acquired the extreme off-road vehicle company Gecko Motor Private Limited, which had recently bagged a 250 crore rupees order from the Indian Army to supply 96 at or N1200 amphibious all-terrain vehicles. This order is currently under manufacture at its newly established manufacturing unit in Chandigarh, and will be supplied to the armed forces by June 2024. Today's Top 3 Comments Oh, Mark,